Think you've seen bright? Try a black hole powered plasma ring that can outshine a galaxy. See, in principle, stuff can spiral around a black hole in any direction as it orbits or falls in. It just depends on its trajectory when it encountered the black hole. But if enough stuff orbits around the black hole, inevitably, collisions in the orbits uniformize the motion so that all of the orbiting matter rotates in the same general direction. This is how an accretion disk forms. Now, gravitational dynamics dictates that the closer an orbit is to the gravitational source, the faster it has to orbit. This is why Mercury's orbit takes it around the Sun at 47 kilometers per second, while Pluto's orbit is a mere 4.6 kilometers per second. And that's pretty uninteresting when you have discrete objects in neatly separated orbits, but if you have a continuous medium, like a plasma field, that means that the inner parts of the disk spin faster than the outer parts of the disk. And because of that difference in speed, there's a sort of friction related to viscosity and magnetic fields all throughout the disk, working to slow down the inner portion of the disk and speed up the outer portion. The end result is a large chunk of gravitational potential energy from the innermost part of the disk getting converted to heat as it's dragged on by the outer part. And the hotter it gets, the brighter the light it gives off, like a glowing chunk of metal. And around a black hole, well, suffice it to say, there's lots of gravitational potential energy available. The innermost boundary of the accretion disk is moving at a significant fraction of the speed of light. In fact, the liberated gravitational potential energy is so great that up to around 40% of the energy an object has, from E equals mc squared, is radiated out from the accretion disk in the form of X-rays and ultraviolet light. So, for distant supermassive black holes that can eat upwards of hundreds of suns worth of mass a year, they are astoundingly bright typically outshining their host galaxies. In fact, these are the engines that drive quasars, the brightest continuously lit objects in the universe.